I continue to believe Mr. Trump will not be president. And the reason is because I have a lot of faith in the American people. And I think they recognize that being president is a serious job. It's not hosting a talk show or a reality show. It's not promotion. It's not marketing. It's hard. And a lot of people count on us getting it right. And it's not a matter of pandering and, 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 and doing whatever will get you in the news on a given day. And sometimes it requires you making hard decisions even when people don't like it and doing things that are unpopular and standing up for people who are vulnerable but don't have some powerful political constituency. And it requires being able to work with leaders around the world uh, in a way that reflects the importance of the office um, and gives people confidence that you know the facts and you know their names and you know where they are on a map and you know something about their history and you're not just going to play to the crowd back home because they have their own crowds back home and you're trying to solve problems. And so, yeah, during primaries, people vent and they express themselves and it seems like entertainment and oftentimes it's reported just like entertainment. But as you get closer, reality has a way of intruding. And these are the folks who, who I have faith in because they ultimately are going to say, whoever's standing where I'm standing right now has the nuclear codes with them and can order 21-year-olds into a firefight and have to make sure that the banking system doesn't collapse and is often responsible for not just the United States of America but 20 other countries that are having big problems or falling apart and are going to be looking for us to do something. And the American people are pretty sensible. And I think they'll make a, a, a sensible choice in the end.